Question. Discuss the role of Lucky and Pozo in Waiting for Godot. Answer. Samuel Beckett's play Waiting for Godot features the characters of Lucky and Pozo, whose roles are pivotal in examining existential themes, power dynamics, oppression, human relationships, and the transient nature of authority. 1. Lucky's Contribution Symbol of suffering and servitude, Lucky represents the marginalized and oppressed individuals in society. His portrayal as a slave to Pozo emphasizes the burdens and mistreatment faced by those with limited power. His suffering becomes a symbol for the hardships endured by the disenfranchised. Exploration of Existentialism Lucky's iconic monologue in Act Idals into existential themes challenging the audience to contemplate the nature of existence, meaning, and the human condition. His rambling speech reflects the absurdity and confusion of life, raising profound philosophical questions. Contrast to Vladimir and Estragon, Lucky's presence contrasts with the main characters, Vladimir and Estragon. His extreme subservience and intellectual musings highlight the dichotomy between those who blindly accept their circumstances and those who engage in introspection and existential questioning. 2. Pozo's Contribution Representation of Authority and Power Pozo embodies authority and power, serving as the master of lucky. His character symbolizes oppressive forces within society shading light on the unequal power dynamics and the impact of domination on both the oppressor and the oppressed. Commentary on Dependency Pozo's reliance on Lucky for his needs and entertainment exposes the dynamics of dependency and exploitation. This dependency extends to his interactions with Vladimir and Estragon as they engage with Pozo in hopes of gaining something from him. Pozo's character prompts reflection on the nature and consequences of dependency in relationships. Metaphor for transience and decline, Pozo undergoes a transformation as the play progresses, becoming blind and helpless in Act 2. This transformation signifies the ephemeral nature of power and the eventual decline that awaits even the most dominant figures. It serves as a reminder of the impermanence of earthly authority and the inherent vulnerability of human existence. 3. Impact on Human Relationships Exploration of complex relationships, the interactions between Lucky, Pozo, Vladimir, and Estragon offer insights into the intricacies of human relationships. The power dynamics, dependency, moments of empathy and instances of cruelty illuminate the multifaceted nature of human connection and how individuals influence and affect one another. Catalysts for Self-Reflection The presence of Lucky and Pozo stimulates self-reflection and existential contemplation in Vladimir and Estragon. Their encounters and exchanges spark moments of introspection, provoking contemplation of their own existence, purpose, and relationship to the world. Through these characters, Beckett invites the audience to question their own lives and the human condition at large. In summary, the characters of Lucky and Pozo in Waiting for Godot contribute significantly to the exploration of existential themes, power dynamics, oppression, human relationships, and the transient nature of authority. Lucky represents suffering and serves as a vehicle for existential exploration while Pozo embodies authority, dependency, and transience. Their interactions shape the play's examination of the human condition, shading light on power imbalances, the consequences of oppression, the complexities of relationships, and the fleeting nature of earthly authority.